Yo, what's going on everybody? It is Straight Outta Boston here. Today I'm back for episode number 31 of my Chicago Bears franchise here on Madden NFL 17. So today we're taking on the Arizona Cardinals, another NFC West divisional matchup for us. We took on the Seahawks last week. Richard Klein, still our only injured player, but the Cardinals are pretty banged up. David Johnson out, as well as Chandler Jones, so that's two key players for them. They are in the playoff hunt. We are 7-3 after a loss to Seattle last week. We fell out of that number two spot, but we still have one of the best records in the NFC. Still a chance at a first round bye, maybe even the number one seed down the road. But here we go, Adcock now in the game early. He is going to drop back and find a Jeffrey in the end zone for the touchdown. So we take an early 7-0 lead. Now later on in the first quarter, third and four for the Cardinals. It's Sam Bradford who now quarterbacks this Arizona team. And he finds his man right there for the first down. Now second and 18 drive would continue. It's a handoff to Jarrett McKinnon. But McKinnon stopped well in the backfield right there. I think he didn't even get back to the line of scrimmage. Third and 19 now. Bradford on play action. He's got time firing towards the end zone. And it is intercepted. A good play on the ball by Adrian Amos. Flag would be on the offensive side, so we would decline and keep the football right there. So after the turnover, we drive down the field. Now Adcock on the screen looking for Carlos Williams Sr. Williams to the pylon, and he's in. Touchdown with the extra effort right there. Carlos Williams on the screen pass, and we have a 14-0 lead now. So things clicking early on here for Chicago. 21-7 now late in the second quarter. Adcock looking to go deep. He's got a man, but he overthrows Parker Peterman. So now later on the drive, third and 10. Adcock dropping back. He's going to feel the pressure. He gets it as he throws, and that's going to force an incompletion. Fourth down, we would punt it away. Arizona would score a touchdown late in the half, make it a 21-14 game now. So it's a seven-point lead. We need to put some more points up on the board, try and get an insurance lead here. And that is going to be dropped on third down by Felix Oldham. So fourth down coming up. We're going to QB sneak it. Adcock gets the couple yards he needed. That's going to give us a new set of downs, and the drive will continue second and four. Williams handoff it's a play action and Adcock is hit and sacked so third and 12 coming up Adcock dropping back deep drop back going left side and he's intercepted that was Colvin who jumped the route right there and Arizona takes over no points for Chicago and now Arizona could potentially tie things up if they get in the end zone here Bradford heading off to McKinnon up the middle he's going to pick up about nine or ten yards right there and they're going to give him the first down so second and goal two plays later Bradford dropping back firing short He's got his man Campbell, but Campbell only picks up about a yard, so third and goal coming up from the eight. Bradford out of the shotgun once again, dropping back tons of time. Finally feels the pressure he was hit as he throws, and that is going to go incomplete. So it is Chandler Catanzaro out for the short little field goal attempt, 25 yards up and good. Arizona now cuts the lead to four. Midway through the fourth quarter right here, Howard on the pitch play. He stopped in the backfield. Who's that man? It is Colvin making another big play. So we're going to have to settle for another field goal right here. And that's going to get the lead back up to 7 points. This one a 47-yarder, 48-yarder from Matt Prater. We would get the ball back, though. Two minutes to play and trying to ice this clock right here. It's Howard on the play-action fake. He stays in bounds. He's got the first down all the way down to the 46-yard line. Now a handoff to Howard once again, trying to run out that final bit of clock. He's got a pickup of about four right there. Now third and three, two plays later. Adcock firing short. He's got Barden. That's a first down. Arizona calls our last time out, and that is going to be the ball game. We would run out the clock from there and hold on to the win, 24-17. So we bounce back after that loss to Seattle last week, and we improve to 8-3 and three on the season now, trying to start a new winning streak as we defeat the Arizona Cardinals. But because I am a little bit short-pressed for time as I am going abroad on Sunday, and I won't be posting videos uh, after that for a couple months while I am abroad. I do want to finish this series. I at least want to finish this season of this series pretty quickly. So I'm going to be simulating a couple games here uh, towards the end of the regular season. One of them is going to be actually my next game against the Green Bay Packers. Now the Packers are 3-8. and They are the defending Super Bowl champions, but they're pretty much out of things at this point. Uh, obviously, eight losses pretty much eliminates you from anything. So I'm going to simulate that Packers game. I'm going to simulate the 49ers game, and I think I'm going to simulate the Jets game at the end there and just play three more games. So I'm going to do one simulation and one gameplay in each episode now up until the end of the regular season. So here we are advancing one more week, and we actually lose to the Packers. I was pretty surprised. I guess I shouldn't have been too surprised. It is a rivalry game. Rodgers had three touchdowns, I believe, um, and they put up 34 points on us. They had 21 in that fourth quarter, and that was pretty much the difference in the game. You can see Adcock, actually, Rodgers only had one touchdown. Adcock had three interceptions. But they ran all over us. They had 143 rushing yards from Lacey and Ball. And we couldn't get the running game going at all. So pretty disappointed that we lost that game. Cornelius, two touchdowns. But 8-4 uh, and four now is our record. And that really doesn't affect things in the division too much. So with the injury to Alshon Jeffrey, I decided to sign J.C. Vance and cut Matt Barkley. So we are a little bit depleted now. Jeffrey out. 
with that broken collarbone. He is going to miss time into the playoffs. That's a pretty poorly timed injury he suffered in this gameplay against the Cardinals. But that is going to do it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Thanks for watching. Peace.